on any afternoon in Rupin when you see um, images like this, especially in the dry season or just when the, when the rainy season is just finished, you need to stop. Stop, get out the vehicle. You're not in a hurry to go anywhere. It's a Rupinoni. You know, time don't really matter. And these images don't last very long, maybe 15 minutes at this point. It just disappears in 15 minutes, but the, but the memories could last forever. You know, so, um, and Uncle Bob always used to tell me, he said, spend a little more time. Don't think that because you get one picture of the thing, you must move. Stay, spend a day, spend a night. Never plan with a, with a, a specific task of going to here, to there, to there, because it don't, it, it, it's not going to work. If you're a photographer. Next, sunrises are almost are also amazing. Um, this is Shariri Mountains in the South Rupununi, the place called Happy Days. The place is actually called Happy Days, and uh, it's one of the most beautiful places in Ghana. Um, taking sunrises and sunsets are unbelievable. They always keep changing, and. Um, you feel the crispness of the air. Like every single image I take, I could almost remember the moment. Remember how it smelled, how the place looked, the breeze that blew in your face, the bars that were whistling. You could almost feel like if you're still there with an image like this. And at six foot five, this is me lying down in the ground near the coast, looking through some barbed wire. One of the most beautiful mountains in the world. Behind this mountain is Cancun, and to the right of us is Brazil, the Anrad Mountains. Next. Happy Days is a working ranch, so having seen the beauty of the mountain, you, you, you got to take a walk to the corral. You're going to smell a little fresh cow manure, but mixed with the fresh air and the breeze, it, it could work. <laughs> you know? And uh, you know the vicar was working to get in a bit of milk with cows, milk in this is an unbelievable thing. It's just... Next. This here is, is an image of what I call a pit stop view. This is a, this is in a in an outhouse. At this same location, and, and so even when you're going into a nice outhouse, you have to take a camera because they got no washroom in the world that got a view like this. And actually, uh, and actually, you can imagine the, the breeze is blowing at about 10 miles, 15 miles an hour coming through this prop, so you're not smelling any problems. <laughs> But so this this is is unbelievable. This is a little later, maybe the same day that I took the picture near the near the fence. So you see the sun is changing. So even in the morning when you get out of color, quickly the place changes and, and, and becomes a different view. 